What was your initial reaction to the product? I think it went quite well actually. Yeah. Yeah, it definitely looked better than what we thought it would. It did tell a story as well though. Yeah. About it as well. It was it was quite humorous. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Well, we thought it was. Yeah, we filmed it over two days as well. Yeah, right. and we finished it before the deadline, which was quite surprising since as we hadn't actually used the software before. Like, we got a new camera and we hadn't used that version of iMovie, no, so, so yeah. it was all new, but I think we could use it again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> so, thank you very much. Yeah. 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 Thank you. What do you think went well? Um, I think the editing went well. The black and white when we edited it out of the like things when they were younger and everything that was quite good. Yeah, yeah. I thought it made it a lot clearer to see as well. Yeah, it separated the yeah. two times. Yeah. Also, we used a fade to white as well at the end of the clips, so it and a fade to black when it went back into normal time. Yeah. So yeah. we think that it showed. Well, we hope that it shows <laughs> that going back in the past quite easily. And it yeah. made like more more understanding of it as well. Yeah. Like, yeah, it definitely like a kind of clear narrative to try and. Make that more clear. Yeah. 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 Also we used like a range of credits as well as we had credits at the beginning, yeah. Yeah. like titles, and then we had credits at the end which made it look more real. Yeah, more yeah. real. Um, and we also used rewinding. Yes, we used it when, yeah. Um, yeah, just to add a bit of... To it, really. Yeah, <laughs> to the video. That, but that bit went quite good to it, like, because it was something different, and we, we only just explored it, really. Yeah. yeah, we don't think a lot of groups would have used that, so we yeah. used that. Yeah. <laughs> um, I think personally, the lip syncing went well because it was something we hadn't done before, and we had to try and match it up to the music at the end as well, but it went good overall with the software. I think the eyeliner matches were something that we did actually well, but we didn't really plan it. Um, there was a kind of ways in the first bit of the video that um, Fran was just lip syncing, and then it cuts to a different scene where she starts walking, and it just goes on her face, and I think that really like adds to the experience. I think what we did really well was that we used a range of shots because especially at the beginning of the video we used a lot of different close-ups, medium shots as Fran was coming down the stairs and high angles and stuff like that. But we also did quite a few shots where we put the camera on the floor and just had people walk in front of it and stuff like that. So like yeah. I think another thing that went well was that we used a range of settings because although we stayed inside the school, there's like quite a few different places we used around school, like we used the stairs and we also used outside and different classrooms. So it looked, it never looked boring. I don't yeah, think. No. I think we tried to use loads of different settings. Yeah, and um, there's one shot with the door we used that um, I really wanted the sound of the door closing at the end, so we just moved up the volume of that bit. What do you think could have been changed or improved? I think we used too many long shots in the video because yeah, yeah. although like some of the shots were good, like me and you when we were playing with a pen, like that's yeah. a good shot, but it's too long. Yeah, we had to yeah. cut it down. Yeah. It's like eleven seconds or something. Yeah. Some yeah. of them are like immensely yeah. long. I can understand now why I get a bit more if you yeah. Can't yeah. Watch it. I think it should have been a look more short. Yeah. Cuts. But we'll do that in our like yeah, in the real film yeah. 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 I think it was a new chewing gum as well, that was a bit of an error. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just a bit. I know, I didn't realise at the time, I don't think about it, and then after I was like, oh. Yeah, it's kind of all you yeah. focus on. <laughs> <laughs> it's like all you can see in that shot. I will never chew gum again. <laughs> well, especially not when lip syncing. <laughs> um, the bit at the beginning which we used with at the editing where it says Eliza do little big when I was little, it actually we actually think that it lasts a bit too short. Yeah, a lot of them usually last longer as well, don't yeah. they? Yeah. Like, like I think it's because we already know what it says, so we yeah, didn't put yeah. it for that long, but we didn't think about no, it. No, other people haven't actually read it. No. So <laughs> yeah. I don't know what it, it is. Lasts, yeah. It lasts for like zero point five seconds, something like that. Yeah. And it's just not a Usually a lot of them just play it. throughout it for a little bit longer. Yeah. yeah. One bit we all hated was the umbrella <laughs> bit. We hated think, it so much. I think it was just because we struggled to think of new things to do whilst we because we were in such a small location to do it. Yeah. yeah. Like when it's a real thing, we'll understand that we can go out and go everywhere. But with the umbrella bit, it was like we need to find something to put in that place. And we just yeah. Get, yeah. Although we all hate it now. Yeah. yeah. We don't understand. It was we don't like there's also the um, setting of that bit yeah. as well. There's a massive pole in the way. Yeah. yeah. It's a really bad shot. <laughs>
It I lasts like, for yeah. more than like a second. It lasts for about four seconds. Yeah, and you just watch it just so going. Long. We've learnt from our lesson, I think. We yeah. will not use umbrellas no. again. No. <laughs> I think one thing that could be improved with the framing of the compositions, like when we were walking or something, we had a pole in the way or a fire escape and other yeah. people around. Yeah. And when we were like hugging, <laughs> yeah. we cut each other's heads, heads off. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> there was quite a lot of um, your head being cut off. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's well. upstairs. Yeah. But I think that we didn't realise at the time, but no. after when you look back at it, yeah. like, it needs so, to be improved. Yeah. We've but done it again. That, that was all helping us to yeah. learn how to use a camera as well. Yeah, exactly. That was like the first day and yeah. everything. We didn't really think about it, but no, next time, yeah. like, we'll understand that we've got to make sure that there's not things in the way. Definitely, yeah. yeah. How does it compare with real media products? Uh, well, we compared it to, like, watching our video, we compared it to um, Eliza Doolittle's actual version of Big Brother's yeah. Hill. Uh, just to see what we did differently. Yeah. yeah. And uh, some of the main differences were that she didn't actually have a story in her video. Like she used more dancing and sort of. Yeah. Whereas we done the idea of growing up. Yeah. And, leaving. and having a narrative. Yeah. Of that I think it was quite thing. apt for us because we obviously are leaving. Yeah. Too. Yeah. And that's what we got the idea from it. Yeah. But I think a lot of other media products, like especially music videos, they do focus more on the dancing yeah. and like yeah. just sort of. Not really doing a narrative. Yeah, so maybe which, next, like with the real one, we should think about maybe doing it like that instead. We could. But I did but, like the narrative because yeah. it was like, it was different. And it did and actually tell a story, <coughs> and I think people could understand that who don't like yeah. that. Yeah, I think it yeah. makes it less boring because, yeah. especially, and as well, I don't know Surely how we're meant to film dancing. None no. of us are dancing. <laughs> <Yeah. so. laughs> But, but you do want to know what happens to him, so you kind yeah. of want to know the story, really. It's as like, well. and there are narratives for other pop songs. Yeah. So. yeah like Coldplay and stuff, yeah, so we but just do stuff like that in yeah. one. But also hers was, it was a lot more colourful yeah. and mm -hmm. it had a lot of shorter um, shorts. Short cuts. Yeah. I think and cuts were a lot like, quicker. Because we done it in school, like, obviously the walls are white and that. Yeah. <laughs> so it's a bit like it blurs everything out and it's just like, yeah. it's really plain. But when it the real thing, we'll actually go out, go to places that are Yeah, like, yes. I think because it was a really upbeat song that it needs more yeah. colour in it. Yeah. So I think that's something that yeah. we need we to think definitely about. think about. Yeah. yeah. Um, I think that um, our media product does stand up to other pop music videos, yeah. um, such as Carly Rae Jepsen's Call Me Maybe. Yeah. Because yeah. that also has a strong narrative in it. Yeah. yeah. I know that's not the same a narrative, but it does still have one, so ours could potentially work. Yeah. yeah. And, you know, it's humorous at the end. <laughs> yeah, like that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I think we could definitely yeah. look at using a strong narrative again in yeah. our final product. Yeah. If we look at pop. Yeah.